Now me, you know, growing up, you know, as a Christian, I had certain suspicions when I was young. Because I used to spend six days a week in the church. My grandmother, she sung for the United Negro College Fund Choir. She used to have these real late rehearsals. I'd be sitting there, sliding down the church, man, just tired. And I'd sit here and watch these people sing all day. You know? And I remember I used to go to Bible studies. And I remember just repetitively keep hearing about Jesus praying. So I remember asking my pastor, I say, you know, um, Pastor, I need to ask you a question. He's like, it was problem, son. I said, well, you know, um, if, 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 if Jesus is God and he's praying, who he's praying to? And he just shut me down. Boy, you don't believe in Jesus Christ, your Lord and Savior? I said, oh, oh, calm down. Like, he's about to just <laughs> beat me down. I'm a little kid. I'm only like eight, nine years old. But it was a legitimate question. And you got me in Bible study, so eventually I'm going to come across this. Anybody that's there for the right reasons. You know, not just there because grandma's singing or just cause there because I have to be there. I was learning things myself. And I started to see certain things that just didn't make sense. And he just kind of shut me down. And from that point, well, I never went to church again. I said to myself, I'm just going to believe in God. Because whoever Jesus is praying to, that's the man. That's the man. Because I tried to pray to Jesus. And I can't say the response time was always on time. But I know when I used to scream, oh, my God, you know, it seemed like something was working. And I knew there was only one creator. And this line made all of this clear to me. But once again, you already knew this. You already knew this. I mean, when I was 10 years old, if I'd have had a night me, I'd have ran around the house in my underwear, screaming, top of my lungs, wake everybody up. You 10 years old, what you do? I would be like, man, you shit don't You knew how to protect yourself. A nightmare was a nightmare for everybody in my house. Y'all all gonna feel this. You know? But you knew how to protect yourself. You didn't have to wake the house up. You just ask the Lord, you seek refuge in the law from the accursed shaitan. I hold the belief in that shaitan. <laughs> wow. Can you understand? I'm looking like, how could you neglect that? How? That's a protection. 